Welcome everyone to another finals preview. This is a game three that I'll be previewing and it is the first qualifying final. First versus fourth, Fremantle taking on the Sydney Swans. And we're playing AFL 2007 today for this one, uh, which is basically 2006 without the bugs. So take that as you will. Uh, 2006 was very buggy, by the way. Uh, anyway. Straight to the game. Uh, we've confirmed all four finals this week. We've got West Coast taking on Hawthorne at Patterson Williams, or what is it, Domain Stadium now, uh, on the Friday night. Then we've got Saturday afternoon. Fremantle wanted a seven day break, which is why they're playing on the Saturday afternoon. Uh, and they will be taking on the Sydney Swans, which is the game I'm about to preview. Then on Saturday night, we've got the Dogs in Adelaide at the MCG. Very controversial. I'll talk about that in my next video. And we've also got Richmond and North Melbourne at the MCG on the Sunday afternoon. Boy, it's going to be a big week of finals. And this week could determine the uh, premiers. Uh, I, I mean, obviously, it's, it's still a long way to go. But just think about it. If we get two Perth teams hosting preliminary finals, which is a very, very real possibility... Who's going to stop a derby final? I think it would be extremely awesome. Anyway, uh, Sydney, big loss with injury this week. Kieran Jack, uh, and they've come out today and said that his only hope is if the Swans make the grand final. And without him, I don't think they are able to do that. Tippett's in some good form, but he's still very, very, uh, I guess, at about 50% because he just has not had the wow factor we're expecting of him uh, since he's come back. He only kicked the one goal against the Suns and it wasn't until very late in the game. Didn't look comfortable out on the field, but he did train a lot better. So who knows where the big bud will come in and have a massive finals campaign. Difficult to see. But I do think that it will be hard for the Swans with the loss of Luke Parker a few weeks back and now the loss of Kieran Jack. So that's that's why I think the Swans are going to find it very difficult to win a uh, premiership this year or even win a final um, this season because I think it can be very difficult. Uh, they will have to take on Frio over in Perth and then they'll play the winner of Richmond North Melbourne. Uh, obviously, if they lose it over in Perth. But if they win, good on them. And uh, then you can talk about, you know, Sydney winning a premiership. But until we get to that stage, uh, I am going to be loving the derby, potential derby, preliminary final or potential derby final. Because the way I look at it, if... Uh, West Coast or Fremantle, one of them wins their their prelim fight or their what's it called, qualifying final. We are uh, if only one of them wins, then they still have a all um, Perth Stadium or what, the Perth Stadium uh, run through to the grand final. So if West Coast wins and Frio loses, uh, then Frio will play in Perth in Perth, and then they'll play the prelim against West Coast. Wouldn't that be spectacular? A derby prelim final. What would be bigger? A derby prelim final or a derby grand final? Because if you had a derby prelim final, the atmosphere over there, I think it would sound as if there's about 100,000 people when there's really only going to be 40,000 in that stadium. So they obviously can't wait till they get that 60,000 stadium. It's going to benefit football in WA. But uh, it, it could be a very real possibility that they will be uh, the two teams in the grand final. I think Frio are going to win this one against the Swans by probably four to five goals. I think they'll do it very comfortably. Buddy doesn't look perfect. And we've seen uh, that they didn't look great against the Gold Coast Swans. You know, they'll obviously turn it on for the final series. Probably just trying to get through that game more than anything uh, with, it, with just the win. But... I do see it very, very difficult for the Sydney Swans to pull out a victory uh, in the finals, uh, as I was saying. So, that being said, Frio will host a prelim at Patterson, or Doma Domain Stadium. I keep getting it mixed up. Uh, Frio will host a prelim at Domain Stadium 
and they will take on Hawthorne, West Coast, or the Dogs or Adelaide, uh, which will be the next preview that I'm going to have a look at the Dogs in Adelaide because it's the last game in the finals that I've got to go and it's going to be a very interesting and controversial game and I'll speak more about that in my next video but uh, until then I'll leave a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it and let me know can Sydney win the Premiership well, you know. and also are you what are you more excited about uh, a team winning a grand final from outside the top four or a derby grand final or derby or derby whatever a derby grand final so which one of those are you more excited for let me know in the comments below um and yeah i i read every single comment i don't know why people don't think i do but i read every single comment i always like give them a thumbs up or whatever if i can't reply to them so always always leave a comment leave a big thumbs up if you do enjoy the video and subscribe if you haven't seen any of my stuff before uh and let's talk about 2007 i mean the game um april 2007 we've got a minute here so let's give a little bit of my opinion on it um uh, it's 2006 without the bug so you've got that scrolly thingy down the bottom uh, i couldn't find my copy of 2005 because that's what i was going to play for this but uh, i can't not sure which game i'm going to preview next um could be one of the newer games uh, that I'll actually use to preview the dogs and the crows. Uh, just because I like the dogs on the side. And yeah. Uh, there's a lot of hard in this. Plenty of hard. Game is a ridiculous pace. Uh, sometimes it's too hard. It's just insane to know how to mark. But anyway. Um, yeah. Controversial. I'll see you guys next time.